Hi, I'm Kristen Burt for Red Carpet Report. Tonight we're on the white carpet for the 2016 Costume Designers Guild Awards. We have <laughs> Mad Bomer and um, Finn Whitrock. Why not? I'd be like, you need to be in your underwear for this fitting. I'm sorry. And then I say you first, and then I go, just kidding. I'm not going to do that. No. <laughs> Mad Bomber is beautiful. Oh they all are. I mean, pinch me. I'm so lucky. This is going to be a dream project because the creativity, I mean, sky's the limit. I mean, that's what I say every day. It's like sky's the limit. I feel so fortunate that this is my world. I mean, I've got to imagine that for most costume designers, this is the type of project you dream of. When it lands in your lap, you're like, holy cow. And then year after year, season after season. I mean, that's, that's the beauty of it. I get to keep doing it season after season. And you get to sort of reboot because it's, it's a fresh concept, different looks, different characters. Yeah. That's, uh, yeah, I mean, and I never know until we start. Like, the, this one ends, I have no idea what the next one's going to hold. No, obviously. Ryan calls and says, let's have that first meeting, and then you find out. Oh, I love that. Delicious. It's like Christmas. Yeah, it is. It's so, yeah, exactly. And, and when you get the concepts, because they are so elaborate, and the themes and everything else, uh, how are you creating some of these when you find out the themes? Are you sitting there, are you already, like, wheels spinning? Um... Oh yeah, the minute you read the script, your mind is going. Like, I, I read the script and when I go to bed that night, it's already there, like little creatures jumping across the, the page, you know, and, and you like get all excited. But then I, then I meet with Ryan Murphy, because he's very hands-on with costumes, and we talk about it, and I see what he has in mind, and I tell him what I have in mind, and then we get all excited together, and then I start putting together look boards, so that him and, and the art director, who's... Um, designing the sets we you know oh you're doing 1920s and burgundies well then I'm gonna do you know pops of color or whatever so we all work together yeah it's gonna be a very collaborative process hair and makeup we work very closely together is there one season so far that you've worked on that you just look at it and you go it was such a complete season hair makeup costume like everything just really worked for the longest time it was asylum I loved asylum but now freak show so, it's so rich. It is so rich and very vibrant and, and characters. Anything that um, Ryan hasn't dished up yet that you're thinking, I hope he does this theme. No, I have no, I no. Isn't that terrible? I just can't even imagine. You have no idea where you're taking, where he's taking you next. I hope it's not in a swamp with alligators. That's what I'm hoping. It'll be a very wet season. Yeah, definitely. How about locked in? Um, in a, uh, a New York Fashion Week. That's hell, isn't it? <laughs> no, that's awesome. Congratulations on your nominations. Really incredible your Thank work. Thank you. I'm so excited to be here. Great time. Thank you. I'm Kristen Burt. Thanks for joining us. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and be sure to let us know what your favorite look of 2015 was in the comments below.